the routes that we want to send to each instance. Now, to do that, we have to do a couple things. We have to make a BGP export option, and we also have to make uh, an instance ex import uh, uh, policy. So let's let's work through this. So let's say we want to send 192.168.1 through 5 to lettuce and 6 you know let's make this simple let's say 1 through 6 to lettuce and 26 through 29 we're gonna send to bacon tomato and 240 and 245 and 0 uh, are going to no one those are staying internal so to do that we have to go back and take a look at our settings. Edit routing instances. Let's look at lettuce first. Routing options. Alright, so auto exports turned on. Let's go up one. Let's go to protoc show protocols. Now we have an export BGP lettuce defined. Show show policies. So export BGP lettuce. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go and select. We want to make this really meaningful and match certain routes. So to do this, let's let's take a look. So the first thing we want to do is. Look at our static routes, which we have none. So let's do sh protocol OSPF. So we want to send one through six to lettuce. So we want to set term term one from route filter or longer. Let's do commit check on that. Let's commit that. So right now, once this commits, we should be sending routes to lettuce. But there's one more option that we have to do. It's not going to work. And the reason why it's not going to work is because we have to also tell the instance to export those routes before the BGP process has access to them. So let me show you it not working first and you'll see what I mean. We're going to go down to lettuce. Show route on lettuce. Lettuce isn't getting anything. Now let's go back up to our BGP process. Let's do set routing instance lettuce. And what we have to do here is we have to tell it to import those routes into the rib instance import export PGP lettuce you could make these separate but for the sake of convenience I'm gonna make them the same now let's go down to lettuce and take a look there's our routes. Notice they're just getting one through six from BGP so that's working. So now the next piece of this that we have to work on is how do we send these routes back to our core and we have to make another export policy to do that. So in order to do that this is what we're going to use.
we're going to do show policy options we're going to do set policy options export OSPF term term one from protocol direct then accept we want to export directly connected interfaces the other thing that we want to do is we want to take from the instance lettuce we want to add a route filter right let's take a look at that real quick let's go down to show route table let's take a look so we got seven routes we have seven routes we do not want to send all seven of those routes to uh, internal like let's say they sent us too many say we only want to send the first three so what we want to do is 10 1.0 slash 24 exact two three so now we're sending those three routes to OSPF right but now we gotta tell OSPF to use this policy the other thing the other thing we have to do is add this the other part of that which is tell it to actually do it So now that we're doing that, and here we are, there's our routes. The 10.125.1, 125.2, and 125.3. Those routes have come through OSPF, and they've been redistributed from BGP. Now, there's something else I also want to do to these routes, which I think will be helpful. So let's go back to our firewall show policies policy options the other thing I would like to do to these routes is also to tag them so set policies policy options export OSPF term 2 then tag I'd like them to be tagged as coming from lettuce so they don't get mixed up from with with routes from other people so we can always have a clean tag to know it came from one particular place so as we can see the routes are here from lettuce now we have to determine what we're gonna send let's check let's check on lettuce real quick you'll see that lettuce still has the routes that we're sending him so now there's just one more left to do and that's bacon tomato so you see we have three routes from them but let's say that we're only going to really we only really want the first two routes let's say the third one was sent by mistake so we're not going to accept all the routes from them and the other issue is that we're not going to send them all of our routes again like lettuce we're only going to send them certain routes so to do that we need to go back down to